Well, the real estate market is still booming, and the experts are saying the seller's market won't be ending anytime soon. In November, there were 550 total home sales in the metro area. That's up 16% over a year ago. But the new listings are drying up. There's only so much inventory. Supply and demand tells you prices are going to go up. John Mangus from Remax says continued low mortgage rates and millennials realizing it's cheaper to buy than rent create the hot market nationwide. It's really attracted the millennials to clean up the credit, get rid of the student loans, you know, do the things that they needed to do so that they would put themselves in a position to qualify for a low interest rate loan and buy their first house. That's really been the impetus to drive the market. Lenders are slammed with mortgage applications and refinances. Maybe you already have a low rate? Well, check again. You might save more money. Bill McConnell from PNC Bank. Look at what your interest rate is and then find out so many different ways through the internet to find out what rates are today. And then when you're doing that, think through too. 15-year mortgage appropriate for me, 30-year mortgage appropriate, appropriate for me, because there's a lot of difference 15 years in paying that interest. So really take a lot of things into consideration as you make it, not just the rate. There's closing costs, there's other costs associated with, so really pay attention to it, but do the math. Last year, the median home price in Toledo jumped about 8%. That trend should continue this calendar year.